Greetings, comrades. Open Given Game is back with my April 2017 indie box. At last, it's finally here. It is Super Meat Boy. Now, before I continue, a few more things. First, this is the third indie game I got from Indie Box since I started, since I subscribed back in October 2015, where it's a game I already own. The other two being Freedom Planet and Nuclear Throne, so I'm going to give those. So I'm going to give the steam here for this away to random friend. And yes, you see the i5 in the background. Quick note, I just ordered a few more parts for Proteus yesterday. The motherboard, I'm finally going for the Asus Z170A, DDR4 of course. Uh, the case is going to be an NZXT Phantom 410. And I got a TP-Link um, PCIe wireless adapter, which is 1300 mega megabits per second, which is more than four times faster than my USB dongle. And interesting thing, um, a few days prior to this, I just got a cute little card from IndieBox. <laughs> so it's in, just covered in glitter for some reason. A very special letter from Team Meat. And it says, You're dumb. Yeah, thanks, Dr. Fetus. <laughs> Classic little, uh... It's gonna go there. And we got the usual newsletter. And something interesting. But there's a pamphlet, Slime Sun, on the back, exclusive demo. This looks like an interesting name. Slime's not get eaten by a giant worm. Escape its innards before you get digested. Try out the exclusive demo. Um, probably sure you have to be an indie box member. Do that, so yeah. Good luck using that. Anyway, give me a minute to open this indie box and we'll see what's inside. Alright, I've opened the indie box and these are the contents. No, the i5 is not among them. That would be pretty cool if you get a full i5 processor in any box. That'll be the day. Anyway, not too much this time around, but I will admit I was not expecting this. This is Dr. Fetus's level skipper. Apparently, um, you press a button, apparently makes noises or something. Of course, it's got the batteries in it, but, um, yeah, I'll let you know what those noises are in the description of this video. There's yeah, still some glitter on the desk from that card. And here's something interesting. Meat cubes. Apparently, um, let it focus real quick. 48 meat cubes that can be assembled into a super meat boy figure or left to rot as a pile of dead meat. Hmm. Interesting. And of course, there's Dr. Fierce himself, the asshole. And of course, the prerequisite, you know, let's look at the cover first <laughs> you can see it's all covered up stupid <laughs> speaking of yeah I can barely see it there super dumb boy <laughs> yeah Dr. Fetus does not like meat boy can you tell yeah stupid 100% <laughs> meat certified grade F network net weight 0.9 pounds price 1599 well yeah, Super Meat Boy's been around for quite a while. Like I said, if you never heard of Super Meat Boy, then you don't pay much attention to the indie game scene. Safe family instructions. Tell me, I'm gonna move it over here as so I read it. It says this food product may contain bacteria that could cause illness if mishandled or cooked improperly. Keep raw meat separate from other foods. Cook thoroughly. Wash with so not to touch raw meat. May contain remnants of bandage girl. Best if used by 10 20 2010. You assume that is the release, original release date for Super Meat Boy, because he's been around for quite a while. And of course, you know, the usual stuff, sticker, structure manual, soundtrack, and game disc. Which looks like it's been put through a paper shredder. So yeah. Definitely worth the uh, wait. Of course, Super Meat Boy's already great. I, don't, I haven't played it that much. I did play it a bit on the 360. It's a fun game, if really difficult. But that's kind of the point. But yeah, um, you know what? I'll be right back. I'm going to get a few batteries. I think I have a few on hand, and we're going to see what kind of uh, sounds this thing makes. One second. All right, so this thing uses two AAA batteries. I think I have a few on hand. Now, let's see what this thing is. Dr. Fetus's Level Skipper. This message is special because it can only be heard by morons. Please never forget that you are a failure. The person that pressed this button is an idiot. This message is special because it can only be heard by morons. Please never forget that you are a failure. The person 
person that pressed this button is an idiot. Fuck you, Dr. Fetus. <laughs> anyway. I was not expecting this. Honestly, I was expecting like a small Super Meat Boy figure. Well, I wish it was half granted. It technically is where you had to build it yourself. But hey, I don't mind it. So yeah, those are the batteries I used. So yeah, Slime Son looks interesting. Might check that out later. Okay, there's the usual newsletter. Tell you what's in it. Now, for some reason, it showed this card in the newsletter, assuming that it would come in the box. But no, I actually got this before the box even came, like two or three days ago. I still don't know why it's covered in glitter and stuff. That's all over my desk. I hope I don't get any of my keyboard. But yeah. That's this month. That's April's indie box. And the next indie box, May 2017's indie box, is a game called Nefarious, which I've never heard of. Apparently, you play as a villain that captures princesses and you do like reverse boss battles. Like you're the boss and you fight the heroes and stuff like that. So it's kind of a reverse. Uh, a s roll switch RPG or whatever, whatever you want to call it. Roll reversal. Look at that. Maybe go easy on the glitter next time, Indie Box. <laughs> anyway, that's April 2017's Indie Box, Super Meat Boy. As I mentioned, this is a game I already own, so I'm going to give the Steam key to a friend on Steam. And yeah, got a little Dr. Fetus level skipper. Meat cubes, you can make it to your own Meat Boy or let it rot. If you so desire, and of course, the usual game, soundtrack, yada, 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 you know, all that stuff. So, that's April 2017's Indie Box, and this is Unforgiven Caleb, signing out.